Rainbow flags and confetti fill the air as throngs of people take to the streets of New York for the annual Gay Pride Parade. Some 150,000 marched and an estimated 4 million watched from the sidelines as colorful floats, motorcycles, and politicians went by. It's particularly significant this year on the 50th anniversary of the Stonewall Riots. This represents a full, the dream fulfilled that we had when we were a small group of activists trying to get a movement going. On June 28, 1969, a police raid on a gay bar called the Stonewall Inn triggered six nights of clashes between police and the local gay community. It helped launch the modern gay rights movement in the United States. But for some, Stonewall and the fight is not over. You feel a lot of pride being in front of Stonewall and knowing how much change has happened, but then you also realize that today still in much of this country you can get married to a person of the same sex on Monday and then go to work on Tuesday and be fired because now they know you're gay and that's perfectly legal. Many marchers carried anti-Trump signs, calling for renewed pressure on the administration that has moved repeatedly to restrict gay rights.